The last tool from the Selection Tools group is Cube Selection, which allows you to select parts of the object. In the workspace, create an object selected and use the Cube Selection tool. A cube is added in the object by its XYZ deformation marker. When you point the mouse cursor over one of the axes, deforming the cube, select the part of the object to be highlighted. Let's take a look at the settings panel of this tool. Units. Select Units of Measurement The next column is the size of the cube of the selection. By changing the numerical value in the index entry field, resize the cube on one side, left, right, bottom, top, back, front. Hovering the mouse cursor over the slider, you can change the value manually. You can also perform the same action in the projection window using the deformation markers of this tool. The next value on the cube selection palette is exact selection. Enabling this allows you to create a more precise selection by cutting the object with segment lines along the edge of the cube selection tool and highlighting polygons in the center. When enabled, only the polygons that fall within the edge of the tool can be selected. The next value is transparency. This enables or disables the transparency of the object while the tool is in action. To confirm the action of the tool, press OK or press Cancel.